big group and then uh, halfway through, I guess, on the stairs, uh, Catherine went in for a little attack. Uh, I kind of saw their uh, mistake that Crystal made and uh, went around and figured out to jump on the, one of the fastest wheels in the world. And uh, so we teamed up and uh, worked together and then, uh, yeah, I used a little bit of my uh, maybe running skills, you know. I haven't been to Australia. <laughs> I didn't go to Australia. I didn't do the World Cup. Catherine's coming off at full mountain bike season, and I had a little bit more time to prepare for cross Pacific stuff. So I, I pinned it through the sand, and then uh, yeah, tried to just bring it to the finish. What does the celebration look like tonight? Oh, whew, geez, uh, I'm gonna have some water, and then some more water, pizza maybe, and. Uh, yeah, it's a it's a tough one, you know. I fly to Wisconsin tomorrow for the second World Cup this weekend, so not a big party for me this time around. I think I'll save it for next weekend. <laughs> what does it mean for you to win the, the last Vegas Cross Vegas here in Vegas? Um, yeah, I don't know. I'm not a very sentimental kind of person. I think it's just awesome. It's been such an such an amazing event, you know. We we weren't really sure what we were getting ourselves into when we first came out here, and uh, uh, the last I think ten years or whatever it's been spectacular you know it's a it's definitely a great addition to Interbike and I always love racing here the crowd is amazing so thank you guys for having us and thank to Brooke for putting it on. What do you think this event has added to the growth of U.S. Cross and it being the first World Cup and the growth of this event and the growth of U.S. Cross as a whole? Oh well, I think um, well first of all kept all of us healthier, you know, because it was a finally chance to get out of the <laughs> trade show and do have a, you know, have a kind of uh, be closer to what we do normally, you know. So, um, and as far as, you know, the growth of uh, cyclocross in the U.S., I think it's it's done so much. It's hard to describe, but people get so excited in the entire industry. You know, there were maybe people that were in the bike industry and never seen a cross race before. And this was a chance for them to come out and see the show and maybe you know maybe get more interested and uh, put more money into it and uh, or even pick up a cross bike and go, go ride it and realize how cool it is you know oh, well thank you and congratulations so much on your win tonight thank you